Uh, so let's see, today is April 26th. Um, it's about lunchtime. Uh, just sat down, uh, kind of let some of this heat burn off. Um, doing a climb today up to, I think, around 8,500 feet. Um, we uh, got out of Cajon uh, Junction, which was just a few fast food restaurants and one hotel. Um, got out of there yesterday. Uh, I think we waited till about three o'clock and then we, uh, took off. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was pretty hot. I forget how high it was up to maybe 90. Um, and we only did about five miles. I uh, hit some trail magic, uh, had a couple Gatorades and, uh, made camp for the night there, which was right at the base of this climb. So today we've been climbing all day, uh, to get up to the top. Here's my lunch view. I'll show you it. So it's not too bad right now. I'm sitting in the shade, but there's some clouds that have uh, kind of built in, which uh, will make it nice uh, doing the last six miles here. Um, and then uh, we're going to set camp there, which will be like a 17-mile day. And that'll give us five tomorrow um, to get out to uh, Route 2, I think it is. And then uh, we're going to go down into Wrightwood. Um, and uh, do a proper resupply and everything and get ready for the next uh, uh, the next big one, which uh, I can't remember the name of it, but it's got snow on it and it's kind of uh, iffy. So a lot of uh, a lot of snow hiking across the top and uh, micro spikes and all that good stuff. So but uh, right now I'm waiting for Woofy and uh, Burrito. Woofy wasn't feeling well, so. Uh, he stopped a little ways back, so I'm waiting for them to catch up. And then uh, tomorrow, uh, or when we hike out, uh, Double Zero and um, Skipper's going to join us because they want to go over over top of uh, the snow. And then uh, Happy Feet and, uh, or no, not Double Zero, um, uh, Cheese Lizard. I actually don't like that name, but that's what I call her. Uh, Double Zero and Happy Feet are going to wait uh, in all 10 forests and then uh, pick it back up there. So that's a game plan. Um, you know, feeling good, kind of, uh, hiking hard, then taking it easy. Uh, there's still nowhere to go with, uh, with all the snow that's up in the, uh, Sierras and, uh, Oreo's out ahead. She's up around, uh, 600, I think. And she's going to try to do a flip flop, uh, up into Oregon or Washington. I'm not sure which, uh, so once she gets up to um, to the Sierras and then bounces out, uh, we'll be able to hear what it's like uh, further up north if she's actually able to do it uh, or if she's going to have to just come off trail or sit and wait. Um, the, you know, there's just so much snow and uh, it's going to be a while before anybody gets up in there. So that's basically it. Um, just chilling out and enjoying the view. Made a cup of coffee. Uh, packed out like, what was it, uh, six uh, sausage and egg McMuffins. So that's been my resupply uh, since we're going to be uh, just doing a short five and back into town tomorrow. Um, so I just went ahead and resupplied with uh, some McDonald's. But um, all is good. And uh, I got a bee that's joining me for lunch here. A lot of flies but uh now i got a, a bee that's kind of interested in the pinwheel there <laughs> it's kind of like hey what's that big flower all right i'm gonna uh I'm gonna chill out some more and uh see what happens this gate danger no parking beware of dogs security cameras let's go up here to gate number two Gate number two, bears roasting marshmallows. Happy, fun, inviting. So every day this is what I have to listen to. It drives me nuts. Yeah, I do.
fordi det bryder rigtig meget lige nu. <laughs> Every day this it's the devil's tongue all day long. Yakin nakin, yakin nakin. It's oh, crazy. <laughs> Drives me nuts. Give us some more. Give us give the fans some good Danish. Nu skal vi bare høre her. Ehm alle som ikke snakker dansk, de er nogle pik røvhuller. Og jeg synes i min optik så er græntræer det vigtigste træ på kloden, og hvis vi ikke kan støtte op om græntræer, hvad kan vi så støtte op om? Det ved ingen. Ingen ved, hvad græntræernes betydning er, udover græntræerne, dem selv og mig. Hvorfor? Fordi jeg er konge. Kongen bestemmer, at for nu af, så skal det være et græntræ minimum hver flere mil. Hver flere mil, græntræ. Flere mil, græntræ. Det er sådan, det er. Hvis vi ikke græntræer, så har vi intet. Som kong, øh, som øh, Sun Tzu sagde i øh, The Art of War. The Art of War. <laughs> The Art of War. Okay. Um, all right, all right. you've had enough. Stark. I've had enough. Everybody's had enough. <laughs> okay, når du er stærk, spil svag. Når du er svag, spil stærk. Sun Tzu. All right, we're gonna add, I'm going to... I'm going to add subtitles to that also, so we'll see. Hey, this is what this place looks like inside. It's A-framed. Oh, it's A-framed. A-framed. <clears throat> there's, there's Wolfie's peanut mess. <laughs> God, I hope the people that run in this place don't see this. <laughs> and then you're going to need to massage his feet After the ball that, in socks. <laughs> <laughs> Where... Uh, <laughs> We like to call these wolfy moments. <laughs> <laughs> He's testing out, the, this shit up. <laughs> He's testing out those dang so tough far. socks. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, I was going to do that. You got to send that to me. <laughs> that was good. Oh, well, <laughs> what should we do with him? Uh, Show us what you were chasing, Woofy. <laughs> Come on, show us what. Put a massager ball and it fell out of his bag and started rolling down. <laughs> How's those socks doing now? Looks a little wet. Getting new socks too. Oh, that that car just missed out. <laughs> he, he takes them off. Let me see the ball. There is the escaped prisoner. <laughs> Whatever her putt is. Yeah.